rolled up to Miss Mousy's den, uh huh. He rolled up to Miss Mousy's den. He said, Miss Mouse, are you with it? Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> No. What's up, Mario? How are you, man? You come from Mass are you from Massachusetts? Oh my God. They have the Yes. How are you? Good looking. Yeah. Now they tell me you built the plane. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 I flew it just to see you yesterday. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, is this is here. somewhere in here. Yeah. All of you representing different generations didn't lay the groundwork for that. And because of your devotion and your love for Fredo Beach as the camp, as it was so well known as for all those years, um, we wouldn't be where we are today. What is the magic of Cradle Beach? Well, it's certainly hard to put your finger on, but you know it's there. And it's been such a part of our family for a, half a century, actually. I came out here and worked on the staff and because my girlfriend worked here and we said way back then if we have any kids we're going to send them to this camp and we did and one of our children was born disabled and he was a natural one to come here. Our other kids have come here, been here as counselors, campers. The magic has been uh, the thing that ties people together. It's part of our, part of our family part of our network of friendships that goes on and on and on. I mean, here I'm, I'm 78 years old and I'm still hanging around here <laughs> and glad to be here, want to be here. And my family's all here too. It's, my friends are all here. It's part of who I am now. Cradle Beach has been such a wonderful, important place in my life, basically for the, being with the children, uh, watching the kids arrive on the buses, and seeing them play every day and have fun and talk and laugh and be silly and then the day's over and before you know it, 10 days are done. And the kids have had a lifetime of memories and are taking home sand in their shoes and rocks and loving, loving Cradle Beach. I think it's special to each person their own way, but like Jack always says, Welcome home, and Cradle Beach is home for everybody. I've gone many other places, and I've never found another place like it. I think Cradle Beach allows us to be truer versions of ourselves because it strips away your inhibitions. You wind up losing them, and. Uh, you're able to really be yourself. And uh, I think that helps a lot of the kids that come out here uh, open up and uh, it helps a lot of the counselors as well open up and discover parts of themselves they didn't know they had. Cradle Beach is the most magical place on earth. A place where everyone is family and there are tough times like in every family, but it's magical. <laughs> I've only been here two years, but I plan on spending the rest of my life here. No, no, I, I'm <laughs> <laughs> the whole was much greater than the sum of its parts. There's a great combination of things that happen at camp. Uh, if, if you were to describe what we do at camp, most people would say, you can't do that, that's impossible. But you get enough people together, you get uh, enough convicted people together, amazing things can happen. No, no more no Cradle Beach taught me what life was all about. It's about people. It's about love. It's about acceptance. It's about ability, not disability. It's all-encompassing. It's sunshine. It's feeling. It's everything that people need to do to know 
to live life to its fullest. There you go, dude. Thank you. You're welcome, buddy. Nice seeing you guys. All right, guys, take care. All right, see you guys later. Bye, bye. Good high fives. See good high fives. There's a good one. Camera. There's a good one. One more. Down the hatch. All right, good job, dudes. High five. High five. Give me five. On the side. Down low, too slow. See you later. Good again to everybody. Thank you very much. Enjoy your enjoy your day. Enjoy your week. God bless you. Well, I like to think, and I'm not always right, that Cradle Beach is the way the world should be. Everyone's going to get fed, cared for, but more importantly, emotionally, they're going to be happy. But we're going to make sure they know something. Somebody loves you. Somebody cares about you. Someone takes care to make sure that you are rewarded not with the stuff you put in your pocketbook, but with the feeling that you are important and you're contributing, making the world better. If you like Cradle Beach.